Hello everyone. Today, we're exploring amitriptyline, an important medication in the management of certain mental health conditions. It's essential to understand that this discussion is for educational purposes only. For personalized health advice, please consult a medical professional. Description Amitriptyline, known by brand names like Elevil, Indep, and Vanitrip, is classified under tricyclic antidepressants. This medication functions by influencing neurotransmitters in the brain to help regulate mood. It's primarily prescribed for the treatment of depression symptoms but may also be used for other purposes not listed in the medication guide. Warnings Amitriptyline should not be used if you have recently had a heart attack or if you have used an MAO inhibitor in the past 14 days. It's important to be aware that starting an antidepressant like amitriptyline, particularly for those younger than 24 years, might increase suicidal thoughts. Regular medical checkups are recommended for at least the first 12 weeks of treatment. Before taking this medicine. Before starting amitriptyline, inform your doctor if you have allergies to the drug, or if you have had a heart attack, used an MAO inhibitor recently, or have bipolar disorder, schizophrenia, liver disease, heart disease, diabetes, glaucoma, or urination problems. Also, let your doctor know if you're pregnant, planning to become pregnant, or breastfeeding. Amitriptyline is not approved for use in individuals younger than 12 years old. How to take amitriptyline? Take amitriptyline exactly as prescribed by your doctor, following all directions on your prescription label. It may take up to four weeks before your symptoms improve. Do not stop using the medication suddenly, as this may lead to withdrawal symptoms. If you're planning to undergo surgery, inform your surgeon about your amitriptyline use. Dosage the usual adult dose for depression is 75 mg per day in divided doses, which may be increased to 150 mg per day. Maintenance doses range from 40 to 100 mg per day. Dose adjustments should be made in the late afternoon or at bedtime due to the sedative effect. The full therapeutic effect may take up to 30 days, and maintenance therapy is recommended for 3 months or longer to lessen the risk of relapse. Missed Dose and Overdose if you miss a dose, take it as soon as possible, but skip it if your next dose is almost due. In case of an overdose, seek emergency medical help. Symptoms of overdose may include irregular heart rhythm, seizures, or coma. What to avoid? Avoid alcohol while taking amitriptyline, as it can cause dangerous side effects. Be cautious when driving or engaging in activities requiring alertness, as your reactions might be impaired. Amitriptyline can make you more susceptible to sunburn, so wear protective clothing and use sunscreen when outdoors. Side Effects Common side effects include constipation, diarrhea, nausea, vomiting, changes in appetite or weight, urination issues, rash, breast swelling, or changes in sexual drive. Seek immediate medical attention for signs of allergic reactions, blood clots, lightheadedness, chest pain, confusion, hallucinations, seizures, severe constipation, unusual bleeding, or fever. Interactions Amitriptyline can interact with various drugs, including other antidepressants, medications for depression, anxiety, mood disorders, mental illness, Parkinson's disease, stomach problems, motion sickness, irritable bowel syndrome, overactive bladder, and asthma medications. Inform your doctor about all medications, vitamins, and herbal products you are taking to avoid adverse interactions. Closing This overview of amitriptyline is aimed at providing educational insights. For any health concerns or questions about this medication, please consult with a healthcare provider. Thank you for joining this informative session.